It's like, and then furthermore, like the uh, the other guy in uh, uh, Black White Two, Black Two and White Two, uh, what's his fucking name? The dude with the like spiral around his head. He's just as mo he's his motivations are just as good because he wants to unlock the latent potential in every single Pokemon so they can fight back against humanity. That's why he's working with N. And I'm like, they're right. They're absolutely right. They are the they're in the right. I'm they're the bad guy. They're correct, yeah. I'm the villain! So. I'm the villain here! I've made the mistake! I don't want to do this. And then they tried to clone Arceus, and that, that, that didn't turn out too well for him. We're gonna make yep. another god! <laughs> yeah, that's basically what it was. And now we have a Pokemon, uh, Pokemon uh, Arceus. It's like, I'm gonna put god in the Proto Ball. <laughs> I'M GONNA PUT GOD IN A Pokebo POKEBALL THAT HAS A WOODEN BASE! Honestly, what I think the story of fucking Arceus is, is just gonna be like, okay, throughout the entire game, you're basically doing research on the protoballs, so you're, like, using them to catch a whole bunch of different types of Pokémon. Uh, at the end of the game, I think you're going to actually perfect the design for the Pokeball, and your first task is to catch God <laughs> Good luck. I'm gonna put God in the perfected... the perfected protoball. I'm gonna I put God in the in the spherical prison. It's literally got a lunchbox latch lock. <laughs> I'm gonna click this bitch shut. Hope to God he doesn't break out of this. If I drop it slightly and it bounces on the ground, that lock's coming. That latch's coming undone, and I'm fucked. You think that fucking happened in the early days of the Proto Ball? Somebody just fucking dropped their Proto Ball and released their goddamn 11 foot Pokemon inside their house? Absolutely! There's no way it didn't happen! Oh, if anybody believes that that didn't happen, you're, you're dumb. You don't know what you're talking about. You're lying to yourself. Stop! <laughs> also. I know everybody wants to be a Pokemon trainer. Pokemon in real life would be fucking chaos. It really would. We oh, would yeah. not be the we would not be the rulers of the earth. We wouldn't. Yeah, no, Pokemon would be the dominant species, like absolutely. We would like, be driven back like, to the Neolithic like, era. Yeah, like literally, like, okay, yeah, we have we have guns and shit. Th that's a fucking armor plated ah. dragon that's breathing fucking fire and flying and shit. Like, oh, how, how the fuck do I fight against that? Oh, look, a Pokemon that literally drags continents around. To go and fight a fish. Yeah. Oh, look, it's literally fucking Satan. Oh, look, hey, yeah, this thing lives in the ozone layer, in the upper reaches of fucking space. The sky itself is its domain. Oh, Put look. Ball. Oh, look, a literal, oh, look, the, the manifestation and the physical representation of the sun. Huh. You know, I don't think we thought this through. <laughs> you know, it, I've noticed this, actually. A lot of Pokemon that are, like, star-based... With, I think, with the exception of Soul Rock and Lunatone, actually, are Steel types. Yeah, it's like, huh? There's, there, there's Jirachi. There's fucking Solgaleo. There's, I feel like there's another one that I'm already fucking missing. I just like how people are like, let's take these manifestations of the core aspects of our universe, and let's lock them away. That can't possibly have any repercussions on the world as we know it. That won't ever have any negative drawbacks whatsoever. Yeah, th that was the thing. It's like, hey, by the way, I'm, I'm holding the fucking literal deity of all land on this planet. The one that fucking created the continent so we could have a place to live. He's in my pocket now. I put the literal, the god of the ocean in my, in my little, my little pokeball. Why is the water drying up? What do you mean the tides have changed? What do you mean the circular? What do you mean the 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 circular mo the circular flow of the ocean is 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 thrown off? 
I can't possibly I can't possibly believe that there's any correlation between what I did in this current situation. What do you mean your fucking clock is stopped? Oh Oh, what I did last summer? Oh, I literally put the god of time inside of my inside of my pocket. Yeah. And then like a little light bulb appears above their head. I think I know where you're going with this. I see the problem here. So you're saying I shouldn't have put a deity in my pocket. Ready for your final journey. You know what really bugs me? Hmm. <laughs> that Giratina is supposed to be the representation of antimatter and not fucking entropy, which would make the most sense. Yeah. It's literally time, space, the universe itself. Entropy fits right in, not really antimatter. Yes, the like nuts. literally his entire fucking his entire fucking gimmick is like oh here's the distortion world where there's a whole bunch of chaotic shit that's constantly happening because it's not like the real world at all sounds a lot like fucking entropy to me but no it's antimatter which is stupid because you want to know what happens if you would touch anything in that world if it was actually antimatter you'd fucking explode you, you know would... what happens when a single atom of antimatter meets a single atom of matter? Gone. Fucking annihilation is what happens, and gone. a load of energy is produced. Gone. Forever. Goodbye. Matter gone. Reduced to a actually not even reduced to atoms. Just gone. Period. Energy. That's it. Gone. It's gone. Where did the Where did the matter? Whenever my parents get home and ask me where all the matter went. And it's like the Zac Efron, the Zac Efron, like, shoulder shrug meme, but it's like a C. It's just it's Giratina's <laughs> photoshopped onto his head. Yep, yeah, just... Where'd all the matter go? When Arceus literally shows up, Giratina, what happened to the world? What happened to the matter? Where's the matter? Where's all the matter? Mm. <laughs> Like it, it's, it should have been entropy. It really should have just been entropy. It makes yeah, no well, sense. But it was fucking antimatter. Yeah, well, Pokemon. <laughs> fucking uh, the trios in the ooh. past made goddamn sense. There was land, sea, and air. All right, makes sense. Here's time, space, and fucking antimatter. Oh look, it's ice, lightning, and fire. Not earth, and wind, and fire, Lamo. Not Earth, Wind, and Fire. Doesn't talk about September. Imagine. I want to remember that night. And then there's fucking lightning tornadoes in the goddamn ground, I guess. Yeah. I, I Honestly, I'm just kind of looking like... I feel bad for Tornadus. Tornadus gets kind of fucking... He gets shafted really bad. Fucking... The, Thunderous is goddamn flying and lightning, Tornadus is just flying, and Landorus is fucking flying and ground. Tornadus is literally just flying. And he's part of a legendary trio. And honestly, everybody just picks Landorus anyways. Which is really funny because it turns out being really easy bait for my fucking Agron with Ice Punch, Lamel. Yeah, nice, nice, nice fucking, nice fucking ground and flying combo. Bet that'd be really useful against lightning, pussy. <laughs> oh god! So like I said it before, I, I'll say it again. You're one of my favorite people. What? Yeah, he's a lot of people's favorites. You're just, you're just, you're just a pleasure to speak with. God damn it! My, my, my emotions exactly. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Look at him. He falls to the ground. If I kick this Pikachu in the stomach, it curls it curls up on the ground with its little red cheeks. Look at this baby rat. I could pick it up and chuck it across the room. You're one of the people N was talking about, weren't you? <laughs> <laughs> I'd like straight. You, you, you were one of the. You were one of the problem children, weren't you? You're I'd, the guy we hear about in math that gets like fucking 150 watermelons at Walmart. 
I straight up walk up in front of Ed and go, Hey, pussy, watch this, and just gotcha. punch a fucking Machamp in the stomach. Jesus. Be you like, ah! Oh. Machamp grabs What's your up? fucking arms and rips and me apart. And <laughs> rips me apart. Like that guy in the, in the fucking Honestly, Mummy 2. The, the, the fucking Machamp could just grab you by both arms and both legs and pull them all off at the same time. <laughs> like fucking Goro. <laughs> yeah, literally like Goro. Have you seen that fight, Machamp versus Goro? Yes. Uh, yo, but I gotta say, uh, Shiva, Shiva's, Shiva's a pretty, she's a pretty oh, fucking character in Mortal Kombat. The general's making a sacrifice. The weapon can be stopped, the weapon with, can my be stopped body. with my body. But then you'll... Many of my men have died. As their leader, I must leave with them. X, please forgive our foolishness. General! No! Mm, violence! Mm, what you X say? Mm, X be like in future me? games. Violence. <laughs> yep. But mm, violence! <laughs> Extreme sexual violence. And there's X in his regular uniform. Why aren't I wearing my fucking cool shit? <laughs> Why aren't I wearing all this goddamn swag? I impact sexual violence. This is Maverick Hunter headquarters. Zero. It's good to see your What I require? I'm not quite sure. Come on, tea. It's all over. What kind of tea? I'm thinking Gallicers. A nice Gallicers iced tea. But maybe not. Maybe I'll go outside and look for Deoxys and then fucking take that Twizzler and eat him. Yeah, just eat Deoxys. Yeah, he looks like a space virus. Yeah, he looks like a fucking Twizzler. Eat Deoxys, yum. Jesus Christ. Shoot ho -Ho out of the air and turn him into a fucking Thanksgiving turkey. What? Jesus Christ, man. Could you even... Actually, here's a good question. Could you even cook ho -Ho? It's all... It's like... It's, it's... It's... It's covered in fire constantly. Can you even cook meat like that? Hmm. What would happen if you tried to cook Lugia? Uh... Oh, what? Gross. Probably a bird that tastes like fish. <laughs> yeah, I was, I was think I was thinking it would it would kind of, probably kind of taste like fish, wouldn't it? Like maybe yeah. have like a cal have a calamari ish texture. Got some Ew. of that umami flavor. <laughs> hey, hey, listen, calamari texture is good. All you got to do is fry that shit up and get some dipping sauce. It's nice and rubbery. It's got like a chewy. Yeah. It's got like a chewiness to it. Jesus. Yeah. yeah. You've never had fried calamari. Oh, I have, and I don't like it. Ed, you're, you're weak and your bloodline deserves to die with you. <laughs> or it is. Hey, watch it. One of those bloodlines happens to be my precious child. Wait, what the fuck? Sound effect. More what do you mean rich. One of those bloodlines, the fuck? No, guys, look at the fucking credits. Ah, oh, the name just went by. No, no, I saw it. I saw it. It was more rich. Just is, more is rich. Guy's like, is that like his actual name? I, more rich. I don't know. That I mean, I imagine ridiculous. so, considering that we're like in the credits here so it would make sense if that was his name uh tay pig boss 99 uh i want to just give you um i, I just want to give you something for the record about the whole uh, fighting for thing that's when your plan is zero this one was an x playthrough yep played through his x yeah am you play I through a zero when what you am... get that scene what am i fighting for I don't know, bitch. I'm not your fucking mom. He's nuts. You can't expect me to know this shit, motherfucker. I can't tell you what you're fighting for! Figure it out for your damn self! God, that fight. You know what you said? That last battle took me forever. Mm, it's a final boss. I mean, yeah. I gotta play, like. I gotta play the game more often if I'm gonna be prepared to go through these games, uh faster because I streamed a lot longer than I needed to and I kind of feel bad about it 
got plenty of content. You got plenty of content. Besides, how long was this stream? It can't have been that long. A long time. Five hours. If, 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 okay, five hours is not a long time, my friend. I'll show you a long time the next time I do one. Honestly, it's probably going to be... Honestly, yeah. it's probably going to be more Kerbal Space Program. Considering <laughs> that most, like, full-time streamers stream for, like, eight to nine hours. Yeah, I don't want to aim for that. Yeah, but then again, those guys, like, their whole their whole income is I mean, based on stream. That's, yeah, that's how they make money. That's, like, a work day for them. Okay, that's fair. Man, imagine being able to play fucking Valorant as a, as a work day. The battle has ended, yet somehow Why X would you want to fucking torment you right. like that? Yeah, what I know, right? What caused those robots to turn into mavericks? Will it happen to me someday? Has X just realized his tragic destiny? It appears that X will have to solve this mystery one day. Soon. Spoiler alert, he doesn't become a maverick. Maybe Isn't there like a character in the future of the series called Axel? Yes, less we talk about him, the better. I am Axel. I am cool, guy. Nope, you're not cool. This game is cool. Um, thank you for those who have stuck around and playing this one. Um, I will be playing this again with Zero, and hopefully I'll be a lot more prepared, because I was a little rusty playing this one. Zero is also, like, a little bit of a harder mode, so I gotta practice, like, playing that more often before I get started, so... Yeah. Hard mode, Zero. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. So, I'll catch you guys sometime next week, depending on my work schedule and see what works. Um, that being said, uh, thank you for those who donated. Um, I definitely appreciated it. I hope you had fun watching me indulge into this garbage of a drink. And I won't <laughs> be doing that again. Uh, in the future, I might actually work with certain mixtures that some people want to actually recommend. Um because there's some people who say that there are good recipes to put them in like of course there's like a root beer floating shit like okay i might consider I doing that I'll, the king size brownie mug i might i might actually look into that uh something else that's also hilarious that key might actually do uh they're called gross sodas or gross drinks it's at a place we go to oh. called rocket fizz and they have like lawn they have dirt flavor and shit so be on the lookout for that on her channel if she decides to, I don't know if she's going to, things are a little up in the air. But yeah, that's the end of this uh, stream for Planus X, and uh, I'll catch you guys later.